all right with so many variations of the yeezy some being very good some being absolutely beautiful in today's video we're going to be talking about the ones that should have never have been released in this video we're going to be going over the top five worst yeezys of all time but before we get into this video please leave a like a comment and also subscribe and if you do like this type of video i've got a whole catalog of these videos on my channel so be sure to check that out after this video and without further ado let's get into this all right so coming in at the number five spot we have the yeezy 950 boots and when i look at these shoes like the first thought that comes into my mind is just space boots it looks like something lance armstrong and his gang used to go to the moon with it looks like something a hitman would actually wear now nah, fuck that it looks like something the undertaker would wear but now nah, all jokes aside like i'm not a fan of like the two different like shades of colors and like even like the two shades of like uh, material as well like not rocking with it however with that being said like this isn't the worst shoe i've ever seen like it's not even the worst Yeezy I've ever seen. Like the only reason I really put it in this like spot is because I needed something to fill up the number five spot. And this shoe just so happened to like fit the criteria. I don't hate this shoe, but you know, at the same time, you know, there wasn't going to be another shoe to fill the number five spot. So that brings us on to the number four spot. And I can't lie, I sort of hate this shoe with like a low-key passion. The shoe that I'm talking about is the power phrases phases whatever the fuck it's called i fucking hate these shoes the reason why i hate this shoe so much is because it's like it's got the same design as 99.9% .9 of the adidas's shoe range like if you think i'm joking yeah here's an example here's another example here's another example here's another example fuck it here's another example you know what i mean like this shoe didn't need to be created because there's like 50 other versions of this shoe so you know just straight up pointless like i'm sorry yeah but this shoe wants to be reebok classic so fucking bad and it's just not like i can't even lie to you i wouldn't even call these yeezys like these are just a straight up cash grab like literally no originality whatsoever like fair enough like other yeezys on this list like they sort of have something different i'm not saying that the, the, they're good but you know they've got something different and you know they don't look like another shoe you know but speaking of looking different at the number three spot we have the 380s and i can't even lie like these straight up look like a science experiment gone wrong these Yeezys are the result of when you put your 350s in the wash too long. And like, I can't even lie to you, like, the colorways don't even help it either. Like, what the fuck are these colorways? Like, they're just all over the place, like, just mushy, just, ugh, just, yeah, a no from me. And, like, the sole of the shoe is just so big, and, like, it just don't go well with, like, the actual material of the upper, or, like, just the whole, like, design of it, like, you know, just all over the place. Like, I feel like Kanye was given too much creative freedom when he designed these shoes. And like to be fair, like who around them is gonna tell tell them like yo, like you know, these shoes are not it, like you know, a bunch of yes men. But but anyway, so that was the number three spot coming in and the number two spot we had the boost seven hundred. And I'm just gonna say this straight off the bat. I do not mind the V3 of, of these shoes, like I can't lie, like I do actually rate them highly. But um the V1s and the V2s, nah, it's a big no-no for me. So these shoes was like released around the same time that like the dad shoe was like popular, and like these are basically just like dad shoes and like yeah they've just taken that trend and just made it into yeezys and ran with it and to be fair it did see like some sort of success but you know i don't like the dad shoe so why am i gonna like this shoe like it has too much going on like with the shoe like so many colors so many like depth of like materials and like it's just a shit show i can't even lie to you and like i said like the different layers of like fabrics going on to the shoe like diff different depths the colorways the sole of the shoes like yeah just Ugh, just bare cringy and like the amount of hatred i have for this shoe like i had no other choice but to put it at the number two spot so yeah that's going to be it for the number two spot moving on to the number one spot so coming in at the number one spot we have the yeezy boost 350 turtle doves no i'm joking relax i'm joking like like i can't even lie to you those are probably my favorite yeezys but um yeah so cool coming in at the number one spot we have the boot rnr i believe and bruv like what the hell are these fucking shoes like straight up like these shoes i know i called the 950s like a space shoe but fuck me like this is this is a martian shoe like bruv like this is this is something from a far far galaxy that shouldn't even be on earth bruv like the amount of just fuckery that's on this shoe like it looks like you've taken a croc yeah you strapped the pillow around your leg and like you've just called it a Yeezy. Like I'm sorry, yeah, but if you wear these shoes on like a hot summer's day, yeah, like like 
that is it for your whole entire foot like i'm sorry yeah but like it will start growing some sort of fungus or whatever because it's so like hot and dense inside there i'm not surprised that like, after a day out of wearing it you just take them off and you've got like trench foot or something and like even like the colorways of this shoe like like just minus the materials and the fabrics or whatever like the colorways are just so just bland but like there's different shades of bland and like just so just just, ugh. you ain't even got laces you got fucking velcros like who's wearing velcros nowadays like, but yeah i can't even lie to you i can't even look at these shoes anymore so that's going to be it for today's video i hope you did enjoy and if you did enjoy please leave a like a comment and also subscribe and until next time i'm out